Hey everybody and welcome to another Collection DX review. This time we are checking out the Rainbow Resha from the Resha Sentai Tokyuja line. And this is basically a, a first release bonus for the diesel -O and also the Diesel Resha. I was going to talk about the Rainbow Resha in that review, but I figured this is a cool enough extra that it merits its own little short review. So let's check out the Rainbow Resha. So as you can see, the Rainbow Resha is made out of uh, clear plastic, and it's also multicolored, which is really cool. You got red, pink, yellow, some orange in there. Uh, there's green, blue, and some violet in the back. Now the Rainbow Resha is basically just the red Resha. That's backwards. It's the uh, red Resha, uh, the one that you get with the Tokyo Changer. Uh, it's basically the same mold. Uh, it's just redone. But that looks so much cooler. Um, it's very nice looking. Just check that out. Whoa, it's rolling backwards. So, very cool. It's that nice translucent plastic. You can see the insides. You can see the wheels, how they spin, how they're held in. So just all the way around, very cool Russia. It's even got yellow on that front part right there. And that's actually missing from this one, the one that you get with the uh, Tokyo Changer. So I'm going to zoom in real quick just so you can see all the details of the steam locomotive. It's got the wheels, it's got the arms moving the uh, wheels. Got some more detailing right there. I mean it is just the same mold as the Red Resha, which is the steam locomotive also. So obviously you come to expect the same amount of detail. So since the Rainbow Resha is basically the same toy, as the red Resha from the Tokyo Changer, it's one solid piece. As you can see, no breaks, no joints, no anything on there. Here you have the red Resha that comes with the Tokyo, and of course that one has the joint right there. It also has that um, rectangular recess in the back, so you can attach it to the rest of the red Resha. The, this one does not, the Rainbow Resha, just like the one that comes with the uh, Tokyo Changer. So. It's cool, but it's not um, compatible with the uh, Tokyo, but you can still use it with the Tokyo Changer. So that is it for this short review of the Rainbow Russia. This was a first wave campaign bonus for those that were getting this guy, Mr. Diesel O. And that review is coming pretty soon. Um, I just like the Rainbow Russia. I thought it was cool enough that it deserved its own little mini review. Uh, so stay tuned. Diesel O is coming. Uh, as always, don't forget to like and subscribe. Leave comments. Uh, did you like this short little review I did of the bonus? Or did you think maybe I should have just stuck that with the main video, the review of the Diesel O? Either way, let me know.